Welcome to a very special, joyous, classic game room broadcasting from the Intergalactic Space Arcade. It's the Classic Game Room Game of the Year 2012 Awards Show. What game gets the Classic Game Room Golden Beer of Excellent Excellence Award this year as the best video game from 2012? The beer this year will be an Erdinger sent to the show by my friend Sebastian in Germany. Let's open this up. So cheers to you, Sebastian, and cheers to everyone around the world who's been watching Classic Game Room. <laughs> yeah, that's good. I'm torn between recording the rest of this show and just drinking beer and playing Centipede. I guess I'll record the show since you're all here. Coming in at number 10. The 10th best game of 2012, and keep in mind, these are all awesome games, the whole list. Any one of them could be number one, but I try to put them in some kind of order. So coming in at number 10, Under Defeat HD Deluxe Edition, Helicopters, Explosions, Soundtrack CD, it's an awesome game. Under Defeat HD. Coming in at number 9 is an awesome driving game with 2012 in the title, that's right. It's F1 2012 from Codemasters. Job well done, this game rocks. Coming in at number 8 is another driving game that would have been higher on the list if they had just included an El Camino. It's Forza Horizon, a terrific driving game. As the beer gets lower, the numbers get higher. You know what I mean. Number 7 is not a driving game, but it does allow you to hunt animals with a flamethrower. You already know what it is. Far Cry 3. Oh Hooray! New slippers! Can you believe we're already almost halfway there? It's number 6, which is the surprise hit of 2012. A racing game, a flying game, and a boat game with lots of Sega references. It's Sonic All-Star Racing Transforms. Incredibly fun. I feel so, so used. Number five, and I'm out of beer in that class, but fortunately I planned ahead and poured half the bottle into my classic game room mug to see if there was any difference in flavor between a taller glass and the uh, classic game room glass. Let's find out. Tastes like the same beer, but you know, I like a taller glass for a vice beer, but the classic game room mug is superior for IPAs and darker beers, and I'm not biased at all. It also looks cool. Number five has zombies and lots of machine guns. It's Yakuza Dead Souls, a surprisingly amazing game. Tons of fun, lots of things to do. I'm still enjoying this one today. It's got a piece of plastic hanging off the side. Let's pull that off. All right. Yakuza Dead Souls deserves better than that. Violence is in their blood. Good for them.
Now we're starting to get serious. What's the fourth best game of 2012? It's Blockout Breakdown for the Magnavox Odyssey 2. No, it's not. Wait a second. Oh, sorry. Darksiders 2, I lost the case. This game rocks. different than the others. Less pleasant on the eyes, for one. This glass has a handle. How convenient for holding it. Coming in at number three is a game with transforming robots and explosions. Can you guess what it is? That's right. It's GoBots versus My Little Pony Deathmatch. It's not. It's Transformers Fall of Cybertron. We are down to the top two games of 2012. Both of these games are incredible. They're completely different. And it was really hard to pick between the two, which is number one, which is number two. Consider them equally good, but you'll see why one is slightly better than the other. I reviewed this particular game on the PC, so in honor of computers, I'll hold up this Atari 800XL, even though it's not on the Atari. It's XCOM Enemy Unknown. It is known that this is the classic game room number two game of the year for 2012, quite an honor. I'm smiling because I'm having fun. It's that time. Game of the Year time, the best game of 2012, my favorite game from the past year, released on a supposedly dead game console, the Sega Dreamcast. That's right, it's Gunlord. Congratulations, Gunlord Game of the Year 2012. Insanely fun, excellent gameplay, amazing music, and it's on the Dreamcast. Enjoy that golden beer of excellent excellence, makers of Gun Lord. In fact, I think it's time to play some now. Game of the Year. Can I order my Game of the Year edition? <laughs> 